start, can you please join me in welcoming your compad this evening, Cesar! Hello everyone, hello, welcome to my TED talk. <laughs> Thank you, Jill. <Jill's. laughs> anyway, uh, so yeah, uh, this is basically me. For the last years I've been trying to defend that video games are beautiful art. The only problem that I have with this is, um, how can I defend that FIFA's art? I mean, how can I defend that Cristiano Ronaldo's assets is basically art? And in the same line, I found this. Choices! Play now! Um, so I wasn't mad that I found this. I didn't like it because it was an order. I don't like orders. <laughs> At least we have a safe word first. Um, anyway, uh, let's analyze this for a moment, okay? We have this semi-naked man, presumably full naked, and this very angry woman with this terrible dress. Um, <laughs> so, if you ask me, He's probably cheating on her. So, the game is called Choices, so what options do we have here? Kick them out! The Brexit solution, okay? <laughs> if you're going to get a call for the Brexit solution, kick them out. Do we have any other, more, any, any other options? Join them! <laughs> I mean, that's not really your choice, is it? It's more like their choice. <laughs> but hey, wait here, there's, there's some way more difficult decisions that they have to make here. That decision is Apple Store or Google Play! <laughs> what are you going to choose, guys? Are you going to be a slave of capitalism and choose Apple? Or choose Android and be a slave of capitalism but think of yourself as a, as a very indie person? <laughs> anyway, this, guys, this represents what I hate of video games. This is the worst thing that we have in the history of, in the industry of video games right now. Gotta fucking play it. <laughs> so, I download the game. Um, um, I downloaded it to my Android. Um, the game asked me for my Google account, and I'm like, well, I don't want the CIA to know that I play this game. <laughs> so I make myself a new Google account, and there you have it. Gotta make those choices at Dino.com. <laughs> because we're going to make those choices tonight, guys. Are you ready to make those choices? You seem like you're ready to make those choices. Uh, yeah. Yeah! <laughs> Are you ready to make those choices tonight? Yes. Yes, he is! Hashtag choices, guys, because tonight we are going to make those choices. So let's see what choices is, okay? <laughs> so basically, choices is this game where you have multiple stories, different genres. Uh, you have horror stories, fantasy stories, uh, science fiction stories. Most of those include a lot of fucking for some reason. Um, which story we are going to play tonight? Well, obviously, the high school story. Because it's the high school start of <laughs> So yeah, let's play this. Um, so, character name, oh, you can barely see it. Well, the game suggests me to call me Jordan and Lee, and I'm like, yeah, fine, Jordan Lee is. I'm sure the game will give me plenty of choice in the future for Wildstar now. <laughs> but I want you to focus your attention here. Please don't say your real name. I mean, I told you the CIA was involved in this game. The first thing that the CIA does when they hack your phone is checking your choices account. So thank you, game, for preventing that. Oh, shit! Is that me? I'm not me. Can we change that, please? Oh, Mr. Cool. No one can resist a guy in a leather jacket. Buy this item for 20 gems. Wait, what do I have to do to get gems? Is this like Minecraft? Do I have to fight creepers or do I not? Oh! Oh, okay, it's that kind of game. <laughs> okay, do I have any other options? Funny man, for class clowns only, buy this item for 15 gems. Wait, why is this item 15 gems? It's clearly superior to the cool man because you can be cool and funny at the same time. Anyway, I don't want to pay for this, so... First one, can I change my hairstyle maybe? <laughs> well, I've seen that hair before. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> to real, to real, slice, slice, slice! <laughs> oh, awesome, I can pay 16 gems to become a Fortnite streamer. <laughs> okay, you know, let's go for the number one. Fuck it, I just want to make those choices right now. Oh, chapter one, the first day. Um, you, you, Lee, why do you think it's called the first day? Exactly! Genius! I mean, these guys are genius! Think about it! Chapter 1, the first day. Chapter 2, the second day. Brilliant! Brilliant! So, let's check out the first piece of dialogue in this story. Check out, guys. The narrative of this story is amazing. Julian says, I can't believe we're finally starting our senior year! This is gonna be lit! 
lit in capital letters. <laughs> you know your game is good when you have lit in capital letters. I mean, you have The Last of Us, and then you have choices. Stories you make. And now, let me introduce you guys the villain of the story. I've seen many, many villains in the unit. You have Sephiroth from Final Fantasy, you have Janitor from The Land of the Lab, and now you have Nishan from Choices, who thinks that AP Campus is going to be epic. <laughs> You know what? Jordan and Lee, my character, we're not going to hang out with these people. They're loser. Am I right? They all seem so cool. <laughs> I don't expect anything from my character anymore. But they are obviously our good friends already. Aww. It's not like I just can run up them and say, Hey, I'm Jordan. I just moved here. Be my friend. <laughs> Hey, I'm Thessa, I'm Jasmine here, be my friend. No. <laughs> I feel you, Jordan. <laughs> so the thing is, um, I go into the school and I get into this weird patio with this weird tiger, and I find this girl who tells me this. See, you're in here, the weird looking tiger, and hey, you must be new! Love your out, you look, I love your look! But that's not possible. I'm not wearing the Mr. Cool outfit. <laughs> what if this goes against my religion? Can I take a photo of you next to the tiger statue? It's from the yearbook. Uh, I don't get a choice here, okay? It's like she takes it anyway. Uh, it's like the game should be called Choices, not really. Uh, because the game doesn't give a fuck about consent. <laughs> anyway, so this is the picture. So yeah, you have the tiger. Uh, this tiger has seen better life. Uh, it's a scratch here. He doesn't have eyeballs, but that's alright, because there's something even more disturbing in this picture. This fucking smile! Look at this smile! No, no, seriously, look at this smile! I've seen more terrifying things in my dreams. This is what you see when you die. No, look at this smile! Look at this smile for Christ's sake! Look at it! I think Silent Hill's less terrifying than this shit! Anyway, the girl leaves because, I mean, the smile, I guess. <laughs> and, um, Jordan is very sad about it. Jordan is extremely sad. Say something, Jordan! Just let her walk away! Yeah, Jordan! Say something to her! Uh, come back, bitch! Not that, Jordan! Not that! Anyway, uh, let's see how Jordan reacts to this. Ooh! Ooh! Red! Red! He, he mad! He very, very mad! Look at his red! Look at his red thing! He's very, very mad! Let's see what he has to say! Come on, Jordan! This isn't like you! You've been the new kid at schools before! This should not be a big deal! Let's analyze this one second, okay? So he has been the new kid before. So he has been in multiple schools. Why did he got kicked out of school, Jordan? There's a deeper story here, like a very, very deep backstory over here. I mean, come on guys, Dark Souls level, everybody. But then this happens. You turn around to see a little girl smiling at you. <laughs> oh, hi there! Did you see this blue dot? Do you know what this means? They're going to give me options! We gotta make those choices, guys! Come on! And it only took me one hour of gameplay. Okay, so let's see those choices. Um, I'm just walking through some first day nerves! Exclamation mark. Uh, this means that he's screaming. It's a little weird that like on your first day someone comes to you and is like, Hey, hi there! I'm just nervous! Let me on! Let's hope the second option doesn't make you look like a complete psychopath. Are you hitting on me? <laughs> <laughs> this should be the first force that this girl knows about me. How is this okay? Anyway, um, I, 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 I'm gonna ask you some people. Would you? Which option do you think I picked? You probably did the second one. <laughs> oh, you pervert. <laughs> <laughs> what about um, you? I assume the first one. Oh, 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 we have a division here. Okay, okay, okay. Let's ask everyone. If you think I went for the first choice, let's all say woo. Okay, who thought I, I went to the first choice? Woo. Okay, what about the second choice? Woo. Bunch of perverts. <laughs> well, you're about to know which choice I picked after the next act of tonight. And in the meantime, I'll leave you with this. I take those choices, unexpected results, gone sexual, clean hunger, everybody. And now, welcome to the stage, your next performer, Tom Longmore! Well, it's lovely to be here with the 
uh, video game society. I've been told that this is a video game themed gig, so I'm going to try my hardest to stay on topic. I don't like the Irish. <laughs> Specifically, I don't like Irish um, men. Uh, they have an unfair advantage when it comes to the ladies. Um, it's the accent, they can't handle it. They can't resist these damn Celtic sirens. You know, they, they, they don't have to be funny, they don't have to be attractive or interesting. They say one or two words and girls can't think straight. They take one step outside of Ireland and instantly they become a stud. I can't do that. Where would I go? Wales? Ireland? You think that Scottish girls appreciate a slightly posh English accent? <laughs> Poppycock. Heavens, <laughs> no. <laughs> now, the only place I could go is America. As if I'm going to America. <laughs> it's so far, it's so expensive, and it's completely riddled with Americans. <laughs> okay, back to the Irish. Uh, <laughs> yeah, so, um, recently I made a group of friends over the internet whilst playing Overwatch. Do we have any fans of Overwatch in the house? <laughs> We're really enthusiastic people, Overwatch players. <laughs> No, yeah, so um, one, of these guys, one of the guys I met uh, whilst playing Overwatch was this Irish fellow. I mean, I, I didn't hate him then. But <laughs> no, um, we all met up, we all decided to meet up in person uh, in Cardiff, which was great. So we all went down to Cardiff, uh, and one of our friends decided to bring their sister along. And it turns out that their sister also plays Overwatch. Uh, so my Irish friend was thinking, oh, a wild e-girl appears. My Irish friend uses Irish accents. It's super effective. <laughs> Eagle fainted. Um, no, in all seriousness, we just spent the entire night latched onto her ear like some sort of parasite. Um, she was loving it though, so maybe it was more of a symbiotic relationship. <laughs> yeah, so... She became friends, they became friends, which was nice. So they started talking, we, and she started playing Overwatch with us, which was great. Uh, a few weeks later, I joined them on Discord whilst we were playing Overwatch, and by this point, she'd sort of gotten used to his accent, it wasn't having as much of a <laughs> potent effect, and my friend found this devastating. So he felt the need to, to rekindle the, the fires of passion. Um, so what he decided to do is, in the middle of the game, he grabs his microphone, and he drags it up close to his face. Now, I didn't see him do this, but I know that's what he did. <laughs> And he like, he like goes up to the mic, and uh, in the middle of the game, completely ignoring that I'm there in the call too, he, he goes like this, he goes, Oh, you like it when I kill him like that? <laughs> I'll always be here to give you what you want. <laughs> Don't you dare stop healing me. <laughs> now, I just hear this husky Irish voice, and this... Welsh girl struggling not to giggle, and, you know, no wonder the girls can't handle it, because, uh, I found his little Irish escapade worryingly arousing. <laughs> yeah, damn Irish, making me question my sexuality. <laughs> anyway, speaking of people with dark souls, um, <laughs> let's talk about dark souls. Anyone, anyone here play dark souls? Play Dark, Souls. Dark Souls is my favourite game. I love Dark Souls. Um, what I love in Dark Souls, you play as a cursed, lost, undead, uh, trapped, struggling through a merciless world, uh, desperately clinging on to his humanity, right? And what I love about the game so much is that you really start to feel like a character. Like when you play Mario, you don't feel like an Italian plumber with a mushroom addiction. <laughs> and when you play Tomb Raider, you don't feel like a sexy explorer. Maybe a little bit. But. The gameplay of Dark Souls is so mercilessly difficult and unforgiving that you can't help but uh, relate to your um, undead protagonist. The more you play Dark Souls, the more you feel like you're dead inside. <laughs> Dark Souls is just a strange game. Does anyone here know the, uh, the currency of Dark Souls? Anyone? anyone? Raise your hand if you know the currency. We have one guy. Okay, what's the currency? Souls. Yeah, souls are the currency in Dark Souls. I found this really strange, right? I remember starting up the game and thinking, damn, souls have lost a lot of value. <laughs> souls have gone through some serious hyperinflation. I remember the days when you could buy a lot for one soul. <laughs> you could get like, I don't know, a life of fame and wealth. You could buy a life of happiness with the woman of your dreams. 
If you're really good at haggling, you can sell your soul for a brick with a Supreme logo on it. <laughs> now, in Dark Souls, it's 1,000 souls for a sword. What a ripoff! <laughs> Imagine being trapped in the Dark Souls universe. You manage to get to a merchant without dying. You're like, okay, okay. I'm down on my luck. I'm down. I, I want to sell my soul. Is there anything you can give me to help me, you know, like immortality, a superpower, a bigger dick perhaps? No. <laughs> no, he goes, one soul? Only one soul? It's not just one soul, it's my soul, okay? <laughs> what can I get for one soul? Oh, I just, I have just what you need. How do you feel about selling your soul? Or some Tic Tacs. So we can get the Dark Souls. <laughs> anyway, Dark Souls is my favourite game, but the game I've played, spent the most time playing has to be League of Legends. Now, any of you want play League of Legends? <laughs> now, I feel like League of Legends must be very confusing for people who don't play League of Legends. For example, sometimes it is strategically advisable to run into the enemy tower and die in order to avoid dying to an enemy player, so this stops them from getting gold or experience, right? Now, this can lead to some strange scenarios, so I was playing League of Legends with my friends a while ago, and uh, we were losing, we were in base, all of a sudden my friend Theo runs out of base and starts pushing the tower on his own, and the entire new scene disappears and slowly encircles him, he just goes, guys, what do I do? Now, my sister's in the room next door to me, and she, this is what she hears me say, oh Theo, kill yourself! <laughs> <laughs> look at where you are, and look at where everyone else is. <laughs> You're in a terrible position. <laughs> I'm not going to help you. <laughs> you got yourself into that situation. Now you kill yourself right now. <laughs> you drop the yell. That's how you do it. <laughs> My sister just runs into the room and punches me in the shoulder. It just goes to show that uh, context matters. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Tom. That was lovely, but you didn't make any choices here. <laughs> we are going to make those choices here. Yeah, yes, yes. So on the last episode of Choices, the animated series, we have this, this, this decision that we have to make. Either we go for the first choice or the second choice. And yeah, I'm going to make you happy, guys, because I went for the, first, for the last choice. <laughs> because I want to check how, how, fa how fast the place is. <laughs> so let's see what happens if we go for the second choice. What? No! I wouldn't do that! Like a sane person. And what does Jordan have to say against this? Ah, oh, sorry, I take it back! <laughs> <laughs> you can't take it back, Jordan! This is like an adopted baby! It's going to stay with you forever! <laughs> anyway, uh, we get to class uh, because this girl, Emma, yeah, her name is Emma, she will be important. Um, this girl, Emma, and I and were in the same class, so we get to class, and in class, there is a war. Yeah, guys. A war has happened here, and like, like in every war, there are winners, there are champions. And let me present to you the champion of this war, Sydney. Yay! I got my favorite crown. Cheer! <laughs> <laughs> this girl is content because she got her favorite chair. That's what makes her happy. Uh, for example, you, sir, did you got your favorite chair for me? No. You lost the war. See <laughs> won the war. Respect to Sydney, the war winner of chairs. <laughs> so that's the thing. Um, there are barely no chairs left. So there are a few at the very back. So Emma and I, we storm, we run to try to get those chairs. But we're about to get them. As soon as you lose, this one is mine, and that one's from Michael. Wait, who the fuck is Michael? <laughs> Why is his name in purple? Is this what I think it is? Is this the first mini boss of the game? Is Michael a mini boss? Bring it on! I'm not afraid! Oh, there he is! Look at him! Look at him! So what to do? So block his path or stare blindly? <laughs> <laughs> or if I want to be even more savage, mute him. <laughs> but no, I'm not a quitter. Jordan Lee is not a quitter. He's going to be the hero of the game. Let's block his path. Oh! He read, he mad! <laughs> he had the red power up, I told you he was powerful, you didn't want to listen to me! 
You're in my way. Oh yeah? Am I? Am I? Whoa! Man, it's the other way around. Yeah, you saw me. Red, 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 red. Yeah. Red versus red. Do you know what this means? Red versus red. Battle Royale 100. Only two players. So yeah, Jordan, I choose you. Use choices. Choice number one. I didn't see your name on it. <laughs> did you say? Did you see his name on it? No, really, no. There you go. Sounds. <laughs> How fuck mess up me? <laughs> Jordan, you have to be savage. We're not going to for this one. This, this choice is for weak people. We're not weak. Let's go for the last option. Let's see where it is. Maybe I could sit on your lap. <laughs> I mean, I have to give it to Jordan. He has come across with a fair solution because now we both get the chair. <laughs> going to pick the horny option for now on. So yeah, maybe I could sit on your lap. Let's see what he has to say. You seem like my kind of bad. <laughs> <laughs> we were fighting like a minute ago. What happened with your red power up? <laughs> but now you do this to me. No, no, no. That might make it a little tough me to, to, to concentrate. <laughs> Please, Jordan, say, say something with sense. That's kind of the idea. <laughs> Anyway, so um, we gave him the chair so I can later have his dick. Um, so there's only two, uh, three chairs at the very front, but there's a problem. Emma has a problem with those two chairs. Uh, it's not that, it's just I can't sit next to Caleb. Who's this Caleb? Like the bully of the story? Caleb is Arpani. He's the school star, wide receiver, super nice, funny, and handsome. Oh, she likes him. Aww. Just, you take the seat next to him, okay? Give me a buffer. Alright. But if then I fuck Caleb, don't blame me. <laughs> <laughs> Hi Caleb, let's introduce ourselves to Caleb. Hi Caleb, I'm Jordan. I have normal choice. Wow, this is you. Let's see the second one. I'm your next boyfriend. <laughs> I'm, st I'm starting to understand why Jordan has been in so many schools. <laughs> and I also understand why, how choices work. Think about it. We only have like a horny option, right? So I understand. So if I pick this horny option, I can sleep with whoever I want. I can choose between Emma, Caleb, Michael, maybe Sydney. Who knows? But you know, guys, my heart already has already made a decision. All of them. <laughs> It's just like, Smash Ultimate, everyone is here! <laughs> oh, wait, but we still have a third option there. But what's the third option? I'm Emma's wingman! What a dick! <laughs> so this girl who's terrified even to sit next to her, Caleb, and Jordan goes in the like, Hey Caleb, Emma wants to fuck! <laughs> <laughs> what a fucking jerk! Okay, again, horny option, 100%, since the beta, let's go. Your relationship with Caleb, with Caleb has been affected. Whoa! I'm flattered. Is this the first thing you're saying and you're, you're flattered? This makes no sense. And you think like, oh, come on. He doesn't he's right to be flattered. Well, take a look at this. But I don't, but don't let my girlfriend hear what you say. Your girlfriend? You have... <laughs> let me introduce you now to the bully of the story, okay? I mean, it's the high school story. It has to be a bully. This is the bully. Brian. You got something you want to say to me? <laughs> right. It's very mad, very, very evil. I mean, I just look at him and he's already like this. You, you, you know he's an evil character. He's Nishan on this guy. <laughs> I just wanted to ask uh, when the uh, no and uh, are nothing. Oh, I'm a single. There you are. <laughs> <laughs> you know, we're going to go for are you single. And you know why? Because everyone knows that the best way to get rid of your bully is fucking the <laughs> That's the way you stop <coughs> sex. <laughs> Super flattered, bro! 
but I'm not into dudes. This is how you know he's evil. Everyone in this school is bisexual, so you can fuck them. <laughs> not Brian. Brian is straight. What a dick, am I right? <laughs> but you should come on my. You, you should come by my party tonight. <laughs> Maybe you meet someone you like. Oh, don't worry. I already found like seven. <laughs> <laughs> Um, and then, he says this. But, uh, leave your little psychic at home. Referring to Emma. Oh. So Emma, um, Emma starts crying, storms out of the class, and goes into the girls' bathroom. Um, because, you know, we all know that psychic is a very offensive insult for white people. <laughs> she couldn't stand that. So, um, uh, the teacher tells me, like, hey, uh, Jordan, can you check out on Emma, please? Uh, this is alright? And then this happens. Thanks! I'm going after her! Twelve gems! Nah, she'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> so I have two options here. Either I'm a complete dick, but I'm rich, or either I spend my gems and pay money for this game. Also, I want to point something out, okay, guys? You see how this name is Jacob, and the teacher is different, and you have like the little YouTube channel here, and an A. This is because this is not my gameplay. I, I, took a, I forgot to take a screenshot of, the, of this one. Um, so I took one from the internet. Take a look at this. You see how the, 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 the yellow graph here? This is, where, this, this is supposed to tell you how many gems you have. And this guy blurb it. So even the people that record and gameplay about this and not this game are ashamed of playing and paying for the fucking gems! <laughs> anyway, so I get to the bathroom and I'm like, I'm ugly! And I'm like, no, you're not. <laughs> I'm stupid! No, you're not. <laughs> I'm ugly! Yes, you are. <laughs> and because in the girls' bathroom, this happens. Boom, oh, right. Get out! <laughs> Get out! I mean, pretty, pretty understandable reaction, but because this is choices, as soon as I get out, first question: Are you currently planning to attend to homecoming dance? <laughs> and because this is choices, <laughs> I'll think about it. Nah, nah, nah. Yeah, there we go. I need a first. I need a date now. No, I mean, I'm gonna know. Do you want to be my date? Yeah, we got it. <laughs> <laughs> um, you know what makes me sad about this? Uh, that this represents uh, what video games can be if you hmm. mistreat them. <laughs> this is the worst part of video games. Like, let me show you something. Um, these are the only four emotions that Jordan has within the, the whole game. Um, this makes me sad. Because it's kind of saying, why do you need emotions in video games, right? Why, why do you need. The Last of Us, Dark Souls, Undertale, but you can have four emotions and make people buy gems. <laughs> you have Angry Jordan, because he's not having a dick inside him right now. <laughs> you have Sad Jordan, because he doesn't have a dick inside him right now. <laughs> you have Surprise Jordan, because he has a dick inside him right now. <laughs> and you have Happy Jordan. The Jordan that is happy because you spend five pounds in buying two gems. The Jordan that is happy because you're playing this game and not a good one with a good story. The Jordan Lee that is happy because he got to see it in Michael's battle. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. Alright, alright, alright. Enough with choices. Do you guys want to see some improv?
So for this game, I'm going to need Carl, Patrick, and Jay and Jim. This is awful. Okay, so I need. So this game is called Shopping Channel, and I need, I need Jake and Jim to leave the room. Get the fuck out. <laughs> okay, so how this game works is we're going to have uh, this, those two guys are going to try to sell us a product because this is a TV channel. However, they don't know what product I'm selling. So it's up to these two beautiful guys to mimic the product so they can guess what it is. So we need three products one for Patrick, one for Kyle, and a third big one that they're going to sell. So, those pros are going to come from your suggestions. So please, can we have a product uh, related, game related for Kyle, please? A toilet wall holder. <laughs> That's not what you can Anything else? A sweet drill. <laughs> Anything else? <laughs> oh, do you want to go for the seat drill? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, what's so special about it? Or that's yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. What about Patrick? No, 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 we get a special. Okay, we can get a special. So what's special for the seat drill? We need something special. It's made of ham. It's made of ham. Are you okay with that? Yeah. Cool. What about Patrick? A knife. Okay. <laughs> I don't know how that's video you related. But... Muscles that only let you see an 8 bit. <laughs> Okay, that's what you can always see in I think that's a special one. Yeah, yeah. Okay, and now we need for both of them a very big object that we're going to sell after this first object. Bowser. Something. Sorry? Bowser. <laughs> 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 do it. Are you, okay? are you okay with Bowser? I mean, I prefer something else. No, let's do it. <laughs> Alright, <okay. laughs> right, I'm quick. <laughs> okay, so. I now need your help. At the count of three, can you call Jim and Jay back in? So we're going to say Jim, Jay, back in at the count of three, okay? So one, two, three. Jim, Jay, back in! <laughs> Hello, and welcome to Steam, the premier digital storefront, now physical. <laughs> we've got all kinds of games for you. We've got a crappy simulator. We've got that game you have all the DLC for, but not one DLC. We've got some booby games. And this... <laughs> we're selling a nerd! <laughs> we're selling a robot with eyes. An eye robot. It's not a game. Uh, glass... A 2D... We're selling a 2D item. No, not 2D. It's Wait. Hello, stranger. What are you buying? It's a shit reference, but uh, we'll go with it. Uh, we've got for you a uh, Coke machine, <laughs> a, uh, a, a fan, a portable fan, a, a drill. That's yeah. it. So this nerd, <laughs> so this gamer, is selling gamers. We're selling a box, a, 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 a NES Mini, an Ouya. Ouya's <laughs> <laughs> back! Not an older than Ouya. A Dreamcast, a NES controller, an Xbox controller, a joystick, a sword, a Wiimote. <laughs> Glasses. Google glasses. Is it? Oh, is it 
it's some kind of power-up that is glasses in the video game. <laughs> Think of all technicalities in the game, resolution and stuff. Oh, well, it's the graphics settings. <laughs> it's what? Uh, frame rate. <laughs> uh, uh, quality. Switchy <laughs> aliasing. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
plant space. <laughs> <laughs> Something to do with bacon. <laughs> so well, close to bacon, pork, sausage. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah, why can't I just do this? <laughs> what can you do with cakes? That's the only thing! <laughs> 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 yes! yes. Everybody's ham. No! no. <laughs> it's a seed drill that tastes like ham. <laughs> One syllable, bow. <laughs> it's the bow of something. The second syllable. Oh, they're teaming up, they're doing that badly. <laughs> bow, Kyle. <laughs> Switch! It's a Bowser crown. <laughs> So for this next game, I'm going to need Jim, Patrick, and Jay. So this game is called the, the Three Headed Expert. In this game, I'm going to interview an expert in a in a field uh, related to video games. But there's a problem. There are not three people, but just one person with three heads. <coughs> and each head can only say one word at a time. So, where are these guys an expert on? Solid battle. <laughs> <laughs> That's too good, yeah, I'm going to go for that. The Legend of Zelda timeline. <laughs> That's a good one as well. The Sonic timeline. <laughs> to the show today, guys. Um, so what's your name? My name is Smiggity Duda. Jeez. Alright, so how do you become an expert on cell timelines? Well, I read a lot of manuals on Wikipedia. <laughs> Or the video games were more important? Um, well. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Depends, really, on how you view knowledge. <laughs> <laughs> Described Zelda as a typical Greek game. <laughs> So sweet to wasn't alive at that time. Um, so what do you think about uh, Ocarina of Time timeline? Ooh, well... <laughs> <laughs> Epona is the fittest horse. <laughs> so I'd... Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> wow, as in the Nintendo made adult games now. So, which one do you think is the most important in terms of the whole timeline? Tingles. Tingle <laughs> <laughs> adventure. <laughs> that is the most obscure title that I have played. But there are many others. But this one is the horniest. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah! Uh, I'm starting to believe that you're an expert in sex and self <laughs> Anyway, one last question, guys. Um, are you interested in any other timeline in video game history? Eggman <laughs> and his buddies are pretty fit. <laughs> <laughs>
for coming, guys. And in the end, we did do Sonic a fun work. Okay, so the next game is called Superheroes, and I need Jake, Kyle, and Connor. So, how this game works is Jake is a superhero, and he is going to face a final boss. There's only one problem, he's useless. So at some point, uh, Kyle and Cameron are going to have to come and save him. Because they're superheroes as well. Um, so we need a superpower or a superhero name for Jake. Steve. <laughs> Alright. Cameraman. Anything else? What? Cameraman. Cameraman. That jokes man. Yes. Controller <laughs> for man. What? Controller for man. We're going to go for that jokes man. Uh, which superhero is he, super hero is he facing? Final boss, sorry. The Hound Sea Drill. Sea What, sorry? There you go, to The Hound Sea Drill. Do you know what that is? <laughs> I didn't know what a fucking Sea Drill was. <laughs> the third door. The third door of what? Can I have a real final boss from video games, please? Mad Man. You don't need that. Bowser. Okay, we're going to go for Bowser. So take it away. Oh shit! Bowser? I hardly know her. I'm not gonna deal with this one. Oh, I'm definitely gonna need some help. I can't do this. Looks like you need help from me. Yes, I do, fan art man. <laughs> <laughs> Love me some fan art. Is that Bowser? <laughs> Let me get to work. Let's go with date first. <laughs> For Bowser? Oh. Hang on. This isn't really going to solve the crisis, is it? Perhaps we need someone else. I'm just a guy. I'm just a guy. Man. Yes, hello, quotes Lady Gaga man. <laughs> well, you did, you did my telephone. <laughs> oh god, looks like there's a bad romance over here. There he is. I don't know about you guys, my poker face is all gone. <laughs> so how shall we defeat Bowser? <laughs> Judas. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's only Judas is here. Do we have to solve it? Yeah. Come yeah. <laughs> uh. uh. What did you do again? <laughs> oh, I'm watching the South Action Wait, like what? Well, did you hear me say one about battles or a half an hour earlier? Yeah, I did hear that. That's about the bottom of the barrel. <laughs> right, um... Hang on, guys. I'm being followed by the paparazzi. <laughs> they might help. And <laughs> blind up their cameras. That's right! All the cameras shining and light. Yeah. I, can, I can see Bowser going away now. <laughs> well, wasn't well, that awfully successful? Yeah. I'm going to see my dad dance. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to draw it. <laughs> All right, another guessing game now. I need Kyle to get out of here. <laughs> now I need Cameron, I need Jim, and I need Patrick. I can't write. How is throwing at a party, and he has three guests. But the problem is, he doesn't know who they are, so he's going to have to guess who they are. Um, so first, we need uh, a hero for Cameron, a common villain for Patrick, and a hero for Jim. So, can I have a hero for Cameron? Earthworm uh, Jim. <laughs> Who's that? You don't know who those <laughs> are. Go away. Alright. Not sure he was even born when Earthworm Jim was. I wasn't. I know Earthworm Jim. Pepsi Man. I like Pepsi Man. I like Pepsi Man. We're going to go for Pepsi Man. Earthworm Jim. 
What about uh, a common villain, a common minion for Patrick? Coke Man. <laughs> Coke Man is not famous. Come on, it can be like Zumba, it can be a like Koopa, it can be anything. Ridley is not a common villain. I don't know. <laughs> and I know what I'm going to do as well. What are the regular metaphors? Yeah, just a metaphor. Okay, I'm Metroid. You're a Metroid? Um, uh, okay. Mr. Rosetti! <laughs> <laughs> so that would be me. I can do that one. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Rosetti. Oh, okay. Alright, then there you go. Uh, so guys, what are you? What are you? Uh, I am Pepsi Man. Pepsi Man. Standard Metroid. Okay. And I'm Mr. Rosetti. He's the annoying mole, right? Yes. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Alright. Now, on the count of three, guys, I need you to say, Kyle, come back in. One, <laughs> two, three. Kyle, come back in. There he is. Oh, oh finally, my party. I'll ignore that my guests are just waiting outside. <laughs> oh, good thing I've got my uh, bowl of tiny cheese Doritos and my Sprite. Uh, oh, look, there's the first one. person, the iconic uh, hero, you could say, for a company. <laughs> Great. Come on. Um, sure. Why don't you go down to the door and sell to the Doritos and the Sprites? I know you don't drink it, but we'll find out. <laughs> or just open up to the Doritos. Hello. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Hello. Uh, very long way to come here. Oh, so is he. Yeah. It's <laughs> a whole ocean. The Bible. Space. Space? Yeah. Space. You know what? some kind of liquid. Yes, that that would have flattened in a while. <laughs> you see what ah! <laughs> I, I, I'm not sure you did say. I'm an animal who's very cross with you, Mr. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> um, well, yeah, you, you think just because you're the mayor you can get away with this. I'm not the mayor. <laughs> well uh, I bet five bells that you'll forget to say <laughs> The currency we use here. Saving. That's worth like a whole rhino beetle. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, sir, sir, I don't know, I'll do. <coughs> Cole, uh, would you kindly of leave again while I think more about video game references? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, okay, I've heard from you. How are you enjoying the party? You've eaten all my nachos. It's great, sir. Yeah. I've made it my kind left, so it's nice to be appreciated. Oh, right, and um, yes. where is. I mean, Could I eat you? Right? I mean, you tried yes. once already. Yeah. How about... Uh, do, you, do you like eating brains? You, you oh yeah, know. I've killed like five scientists and got one title screen. It's great. <laughs> <laughs> what planet are you from? Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> or is that a different 
one. I think it's Planet Zebus. Thank you. <laughs> what are you doing? I, live my house. I never leave my town. The town you named Bonville. <laughs>
Now we have a different scene with a different genre, because Cameron is the new genre. If I say rotate one more time, we have a third genre, this time represented by Kyle in that corner. And if I say rotate one last time, we have a fourth genre of video games. Rotate, guys, one more time, and we will choose this genre. So I need four genres, the first one for Jane, please. Thank you, sir. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can argue with that. So, Dating Sim, uh, Rotate. What about Cameron? Racing Sh game. Racing game, okay. Rotate. What about Kyle? Free to play mobile games. That's not a genre. Uh, free to play mobile games? Oh, I like one of you. Okay, Twitch. And the last genre for my friend James. Board games. Excellent. <laughs> Board games. Strategy. <laughs> Mega Man. <laughs> That's all. Mega Man. <laughs> I have a text adventure. <laughs> Boom. I'm going to go for a text adventure. Okay, so rotate one more time. Jake, what are you? A dating sim? Yes, you are. What about you, Cameron? Racing game. What about you, Kyle? Battle Royale. What about you, Jim? Uh, text adventure. All right, all right. Take it away, guys. Hello. I'm the class council president. I come. So happy. <laughs> Hi! Can't wait to get to know you over this coming year. Hi, my name wait. is. Hans <laughs> <laughs> Suske. <laughs> Are you okay? No, what about you? <laughs> Would you like to meet my five um, curvy friends? <laughs> One's angry, the other's sad, <laughs> the other three are basically me again. <laughs> Rotate! Okay, the winner's face, the winner's face, the winner's face, the best face in the bit. Here we go! Oh. Yeah, well, <laughs> you know what you did? You beat me in that one race and then you lose it all. Yeah, well, I'm going to redeem myself. Yeah, I'm going to lose it all again. Yeah, you're even using my card, which is symbolic. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Noah. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That's why I'm currently using a tricycle right now. Yeah. And this is the start of the game. <laughs> okay, yeah. I'm pressing A to pad. The thing is, I've got an actual car, so I'll figure it out. Is that you in the house over there? No. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Do you want to team up? You're a team. Okay, come out. You, you, no, you come in here. No, you come out. No, easy if you come in here, I've got cover. I've got. Skill. <laughs> I, I have that skin which you get when you beat the game. Really? Yeah. Come in here. I'll give, I'll give you the skin for free. Okay. Stop coming in. Alright, alright. Right, right. Drop, drop. You got drop weapon. How are we gonna work together if I drop my weapon? I need to give you the skin. You have to be. Uh, you know, yeah. You have to drop your weapon. You need the skin. Alright, fine. Get up. Roll two. Uh, to your north. There is a bush in the road. Yes, <laughs> there is a road in a bush. <laughs> to your right is the no. first bush. <laughs> to your right is the first bush, it's a big bush. To your back is the way you came. <laughs> yeah. The three directions are north, back, left and right. <laughs> Which is also north, I think. I don't understand that command. What would you like to do? <laughs> to, to, to right. Go back to where I came. There is a bush in the way. Bushes <laughs> grow fast in the world of Andronaut. Bushes ruin my life. You and Rotate! <laughs> <laughs> right, I've got some friends up here. One loves to fucking read and she's real quiet. Um, another one, she's real petty. Um, I don't know, because you're short. I don't know, I trust you, because you a box of chocolates, a teddy, and a Game Boy. I can get right on that. I have them ready. <laughs> oh, Jake, you're so dreamy. Oh, stay behind after class with me. <laughs> yes, please. Jake. <laughs> uh, Alright, I'm so scared. my weapon. I'm coming out. So scared. <laughs> Who are you? Well, I got my weapon and also all my armor. <coughs> Why are you wearing such a gaudy trench coat? <laughs> Do you have anything to give me any special skin? <laughs> <laughs> are you fighting with me? Because my relationship.
chip modifier just went up. Me and you are the last two left. I don't know who killed the third guy, but... Uh, yeah, you're good enough for me. It's on my trike. I've got an actual car. It's a Volkswagen Beetle. Oh look, coming in from the right slash east. <laughs> Hello. Keep, keep out the road, mate. What, what choices do I have? Come on, give it to me. Uh, you need to uh, get out of the road. Oh right, okay. Or, I think I'm gonna do that. Or I hit you with my car. I, well, I guess I'm gonna. Ah! <laughs> Hello, welcome to high school. Oh shit, it's family. <laughs> yes, I am not an enemy. Well, was the wrong choice for my fly to fuck me, so... <laughs> I mean, you're just going to be friends this week. Okay, can you drop your weapon? No, you're just going to have to watch me fuck someone else. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put you both on to that. Oh, that's not an option. <laughs> your options are... Dean uh, Suter's camera. Ah, I see your back. Yes! <laughs> I see your back. I fucked the man in the field. <laughs> <laughs> he had a nice stretch coat on and he said horribly flirtatious things to me. Well, that's broken, I'll wink. Oh, oh. I'm oh. fucking someone else. They're <laughs> 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 coming down my animated face. <laughs> I'll get over it. Hold <laughs> it. Ah, you're back now. Got yeah, I'll be your fucking right. That's all I had there before I got my car. So you're the mysterious buyer. Yeah. And we have one more race. Okay. Jake, you're on the switch with Kyle. Okay, not. That was that guy I ran over. <laughs> <laughs> not you again. Is this some sort of sick sequel? <laughs> West! 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 <laughs> West! Nah, I'm seeing. So that was uh, the first part of this gig. Uh, now we're going to go for an interval. So please uh, have 15 minutes to go to the bathroom, take a drink, and have fun. Thank you guys. Tell them what's on afterwards. <laughs> so what's afterwards? <laughs> we're going to play some games, but with a little twist. Uh, maybe it's Mario Kart, Blindfold Dead, maybe it's um, uh, Super Mass, but um, the game inside is going to kick our asses. So, come on, see it, because it's actually going to be comedy. Thank you! Okay, hello, ladies and gentlemen of uh, County Bar. Um, this is it's still Joke of the Oak, it's still everything you've come to know and love over the evening, except now there's a, a different twist. Um, so now we're going to be collaborating somewhat with the Gaming uh, Society. Um, Hannah and I are going to provide some commentary. We're going to talk you through this. We talk each other through things all the time. I talk Hannah through making a toast. She talked me down off that ledge that time. <laughs> <laughs> so there's a of things that we do together. That um, was a close one. It was a close one, wasn't it? What am I like? So, um, uh, sad. So, um, so what we're going to do, they're going to be playing um, Super Smash Bros. <laughs> um, and uh, this involves uh, various different characters. What's probably worth saying, Hannah, how many of the people, uh, the, the characters, do you know in this game? Well, Andrew, obviously, as you know, I'm a big gamer. You are! The so, biggest! Yeah, so I obviously know all those characters you've got in the middle there. Why don't you just take me down from left to right? <laughs> um, well, at the top there, you have, um, obviously, uh, Mario and Luigi. That's uh, right. Pretty standard, um, blonde lady. <laughs> um, the big bad man. Yeah. Uh, uh, little green man. Yeah. Might yeah. not, not be a man. And this oh, other blonde lady. Yeah. So this is very diverse. So I think, I think that this, this is going to cause confusion, potentially. So this is going to be blonde lady number two. <laughs> um, so we've got blonde lady and blonde lady number two. Um, oh, this blonde man. He's very nice. <laughs> okay, so we haven't had a blonde man yet, so we're all right. Um, now, uh, who else is there? <laughs> okay, there's blonde man number two, but that's blonde child. <laughs> Uh, okay, so we have, oh, now we, we also have, this is some very dishy characters. Here. I know. I'm not usually attracted to animated cartoons, but... Um, what are you usually attracted to, Hannah? Oh, men in hats. I forgot my fedora. <laughs> um, okay, so, um, we're going to, um, get on with this shortly. At the moment, the characters are, the, not the characters, the people. The people. So there's a distinction between these.
these people here, they're real, and the people on there who are not real, am I right? I'm going to have to remember that. Okay, so she's going to have trouble with it, um, but eventually we're going to be okay. Now, in front of me, we have various different people who I need to remember their names. We have Jake. Raise your hand, Jake. Just so you know who we're shouting about. That's Jake. Uh, Cameron, raise your hand, Cameron. That's Cameron. Um, Patrick, raise your hand, Patrick. There's, there's Patrick. And raise your hand, Jim. There's Jim. So those are the Lucy people. Now, we also have some people from the Gaming Society. So, uh, Ed, could you raise your hand? Ed, Ed's there. Uh, ben, could you raise your hand? Ben, that's Ben. Uh, Henry, I need to stop sounding so manic saying his name. Um, Henry, there. And James. There's James. No, I'm Andrew, you're James. Um, so, uh, we're going to get on with the games uh, shortly. They're picking their characters at the moment. Who's player one at the moment? You're, okay, you, and you picked Bowser? Yes, it's, Good. Very, it's very important. Okay, what, what do the different colours do? Absolutely nothing, but I like to think it's a different colour. Okay, yeah. no, that's fair enough. Psychological effects. You've got lots of psychological effects, haven't you? <laughs> yes. yes. Uh, anyway, uh, Hannah, would you like to talk me through anything else of what you know about Super Smash Bros? So, I'm assuming, given the name, Bros, I'm assuming stands for brothers, therefore all these characters are brothers. <laughs> <laughs> that's a very good point. Yes. I'll check that out. Patrick, are these people all related? Uh, no. Well, there goes my theory. <laughs> we have no others. Unless you have a second theory. Um, they all don't like each other because they're fighting on you. And that means they're bros. Yeah. <laughs> bros at each other. They're bros at each other. <laughs> Which rhymes with cross. Yeah, I got it. It was pretty amusing, wasn't it? <laughs> Thank you. Um, so, uh, we're almost done now, I think. Anyway, we're, we're at least we seem to be about half of the way through. Um, and, they're, and they're ready to fight, apparently. So they're going to pick a, a map now. <laughs> a battlefield. A battlefield? Yes. Oh, we have a little tidbit there. I didn't get to read it because it went away so quickly. Okay, so here, what, are we, what should we name these people? They're starting, I'll, I'll, I'll talk them through what's happening. And then the audience probably know. Um, so they're going to have some battles. They're going to battle each other one at a time. Ultimately, they have to get through the other person's team, effectively, being all those people. Um, it's like it's like football. Yeah, and they've got their little. And like in football, they have their little percentages at the bottom, so you can see how tired the players are. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. And um, basically, what we've got here is red Bowser. The colour's yeah. important. <laughs> and um, blue boy. Blue boy. It looks like a little scout. Okay. So we've got blue scout boy. That's an interesting fact about you, Andrew. You used to be a scout leader. I did used to be a scout leader. <laughs> uh, we were a little tidbit for you. Back in the day, we were never blue. Did you used to make them fight each other? No. <laughs> Why not? Uh, because the first time we did it, it didn't end very well. <laughs> um, so uh, basically, they're, they're hitting each other See, now. That one has an illegal weapon. I don't think that's right. <laughs> hit him with a bat. Hit him with a bat. He got, he got our bat up somewhere. Okay. Up somewhere. Assume his little bat pack. Well, that scouts seems... are always prepared yeah. <laughs> to bat someone to death. That seems like an unfair advantage he has against Bowser. Now, someone needs to talk me through what are they actually doing here? Oh, oh, oh. one of them just died. One of oh, them... it's okay. He came back. So, what, <laughs> what is the meaning of the percentage? Um, I think it's the percentage of which they are just so done with this battle. <laughs> okay, so. <laughs> So my, my, my problem is, Hannah, tell me through why 100% isn't the maximum percent. <laughs> well, I think we already established that, that these people aren't real. Ah, okay, so because Little Blue Scout Boy and Red Bowser are not real, they can defy the laws of probability. <laughs> yes. Okay, um, that's fine, I'm glad I've got that clear. So you want to talk me through, Hannah, what's happening uh, now on stage in front of our very eyes? Well, it seems that, oh, actually, they're both on an equal number of lives, so it's... Anyone's game, Andrew. Wow, that's, so that's a sport that was really very. Oh, Hannah. <laughs> um, so, so uh, tell me how many. Oh lives... no, now it's not any point. Okay, and how do I tell that they've got the same number of lives or a differential number of lives? I think those little pieces of their own faces. At the <laughs> okay. Are the number of lives. All right. So, have. little blue scout boy has one. Who's playing as little blue scout boy? James. Oh, Jim. So J Lucy are down a point. Come on, <laughs> maybe <laughs> if that's how this works. Um, and and they're, they're they're seeking to try and claw this back, I right? assume. Yeah. Okay. I think it's safe to say, Andrew, that the one that dies the most probably loses. Okay, it's like. <laughs> oh! <laughs> so I gather from that that someone did well. <laughs> so it looks like Red Bowser has done good. He does, look, and he looks very aggressive. And, and oh, and he's oh, the little blue scout 
always very gracious. It's very nice, yeah. isn't it? So that's real. That's like scouts. Yeah. They're nice to each other. They're charitable. Now for this next game, I don't know who's playing. Patrick and Ben stays on, don't you? Uh, Ed, I stay on. Ed stays on. Um, yeah, you're not Ben. So Ed stays on. It's like a winner. Winner takes all. Not winner take. Winner stays on. Yeah. I give you a playing table. Oh, tennis. now this character is blue-haired man. All age. Me, I'm not. Really sure. <laughs> 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 your character, not, not you. <laughs> but it is tricky. <laughs> um, so I think we ought to introduce a new convention for the next round. Huh? Yeah. Um, when we're really impressed, slash have no idea what else to say, we will make some kind of explanation like, oh wow, or oh shit, yeah. and that will designate how well the game is going. Yeah, and we'll like when I watch football. That was a good kick. Yeah! Because they might kick each other. The boy kicked it hard. Okay, now there's some nice collaboration at the moment between the two sides. I've just got that open. <laughs> and uh, we're getting ready to go. Have you um, picked a battle? Yes, I was explaining why I need to kill myself twice. Uh, <laughs> so, because I lost, I lost two lives in the early ones, so I need to kill myself twice to make it fair. Uh, right. Oh, oh, I didn't know that's how... That, that's exciting. Yeah, it's like a handicap in golf. Oh. I assume. <laughs> okay, so he's on minus two, which is like the opposite of an eagle. Mm. Or a birdie. Right. Yeah, or, or something. Okay, so he's on an opposite birdie. Yeah, so this guy also has a weapon. Okay. But at the very least, it's fully visible all the time, so it's not, you know, some sneaky uh, attack it's, that is illegal. Okay, it's not like concealed carry legislation in yeah. some of the United States. <laughs> states. Yeah. Well, Bowser just has his um, neat fist. Oh, oh, shit! Oh, oh, oh. oh shit! Oh, shit! It was like that time you were on that ledge. <laughs> Here, Hannah. Um, 
Well, to me, it just seems very unfair that they would make a man fight a robot. <laughs> <laughs> the robot has the clear advantage of being better. Oh, 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 shit! Oh, 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 oh shit! Oh, 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 oh. Wow, wowie! Mm. <laughs> <laughs> wowie! Oh, oh. oh, this is, this is too, this oh, is too hot to handle. The was on fire just then, Andrew. Did you see that? I did, but in a bad way. Yeah. <laughs> so, Blue Marth, that's Patrick. Blue Marth um, is, frankly, Patrick, you need to pick your ideas on a yeah, bit here, Patrick. <laughs> Sorry, this is just two inches wide. Oh, wow! I, I, I do like how the robot very much looks like a Hoover that someone decided to, to turn into a robot. Yeah, I mean, I don't so know... So they're the... back in Athena and thought, you know what, I can do something with that. Why don't you uh, tell me the story of Wally while we watch? <laughs> <laughs> the story of Wally? Have you not seen Wally? No, I haven't have actually. Have you actually not? No, I've never seen Wally. I could never find him. <laughs> <laughs> so he's an adorable little robot. He looks a bit like this robot. Okay. Who makes cubes out of rubbish. Okay. And falls in love with a lady robot who's very uh, sleek looking. It's a bit like a prince and pauper okay. story. Uh, a princess, rather. Yeah. If the robots were gendered, which they were in this film, weirdly. Despite um, the fact. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> that was real close. <laughs> yeah. You could tell she was a lady robot um, because uh, she did little giggles. Okay. She did little robot games. <laughs> yeah, like that. Yeah. That's how you knew she was a lady robot. Wow. So that's the story of Wally. Yeah. What are the conflict points in the film? Because obviously <laughs> we're looking at conflict points now. What were the conflict points in the film? Come on, Blue uh, Marth. There were a lot of fat people who were in denial about that. <laughs> they were fat. Okay. And, and, and Wally wanted the lady robot to like him. But she was like, no, you're too poor. Um, so it's a class-based story. Yeah, it was a class-based story. And also a fat-based story. Yeah. Great. They got everything oh. in there. Oh shit. I can't help noticing that Marth is on very high, low, <laughs> high health, low health, how would you, I don't know how you define it. I don't know, but it looks like Marth is, is, is tireder than Rob, mm -hmm. than Wally. Than Wally. Than Wally. Than Wally. Okay, so this is real close. This has been a lot. Oh, 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 well done, gaming society. <laughs> That's they've won yeah. again. Oh. He's quite happy. He's so sweet. So that's two rounds won by uh, the Gaming Society. How many lives up are you? Two? Two lives up. Two lives up. So that's quite a mountain for these guys to climb. And obviously yeah, I'm thinking I put my money on the wrong horse. Oh it? no, you put it on the Lucy horse. That was silly. <laughs> so, um, well it could be better in, in foresight. Mm. We could see later that it'll be better. Um, obviously in commentary we love an underdog story, don't yeah, we, Hannah? Yeah. And would you say that Lucy had the propensity to come back here? Uh, for the sake of the commentary, Andrew, I'm going to say yes. 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 So they've still got an animal in this fight. Mm -hmm. so if, is this a... Oh, oh, I forget about the making it fair. Yeah, me too. <laughs> it always worries me. So, that, so is it now fair? Yes. Good. Two lives down means Rob's got two lives. Mm. So, so who is this new character we're seeing? This is, I, this is also one I don't quite recognise. What does he look like to you, Hannah? Um, he looks like... Oh, oh. He looks like he doesn't know what he's doing! Yeah! Like, what a fucking idiot, Cameron! <laughs> 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 Go on, Cameron, come on! Sorry, I'm not biased. But, uh, <laughs> this, is, this isn't like support, this is more like, come the fuck on, Cameron! <laughs> it's, um... <laughs> Yeah, I, this I, is I, like getting me to do this. I, 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 I double checked with you. Well, I wasn't that. listening. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, basically, this is like a 21st century cock fight. <laughs> <laughs> and we each got our cocks in the ring. Yeah. And they're having a fight. <laughs> Anything to add? I'll go back to what I, was say, what, uh, what I think this character is. Okay. So he looks like, he looks like a big um, blue brief dressed in armour. Okay, so we're going to we're going to call him the Blueberry Knight. Oh, that sounds cute. Kind of poetic, isn't it? Yeah, the Blueberry Knight. So, so the, he sounds like an underdog. Yeah, and I'm, I, I'm rooting for him. Currently, the blue the Blueberry Knight is getting his ass handed to him. <laughs> he's quite tired, and uh, and and he's sixty five percent tired. Mm -hmm. There again, I've reported the sum total of the facts that I know. Yes. Uh, what do you think of the the battlefield? I, I've noticed they've not changed battlefield. I assume that. Is for fairness. Um, let I me guess. ask them. Yes. Is not changing the battlefield for fairness? Uh, yeah, let's go with that. 
Yeah, he said he said let's go with that. Okay. I like it. the background is very nice. What do you what does it make you think of? Um post Brexit. <laughs> post Brexit. <laughs> um now, uh why is that? Because everyone looks like they're dead. Everyone <laughs> looks like they're dead. Yeah. And that's post Brexit. Yeah. So we're very popular. We're also our topical humour is on point tonight. Yeah. We said a Brexit <laughs> reference Ooh, that was that topical. One, that one <laughs> That one uh, didn't last very long, so... <laughs> okay, so... We've only got one more round of this, and then I gather that we're moving straight on to uh, Lovers in a Dangerous Space Time, I've been told. Yeah, so uh, we'll, we'll talk for a few minutes while they set things up. Uh, you've been enjoying it, obviously, so much so far. <laughs> This is your fault, not ours. Uh, oh, they are changing the controls. Alright. Uh, is this for fairness? <laughs> so we can play this. <laughs> right. Uh, they haven't been playing until this point. Yeah, now that confuses me. Yeah. I've been playing for quite some time. Did I? What do you reckon was happening instead? Mm. Maybe it was a computer program. Um, okay, so you're changing the control so that you can play. You're, you're playing Smash again. This is absolutely <laughs> Who are you going to pick, Jake? Uh, whenever I find where he is. There he is. I. I. Oh, I. Is he any relation of uh, Dwight D. Eisenhower? <laughs> Good old Ike. <laughs> he is a sexy, sexy man. Who's Dwight D. Eisenhower? No, I meant Ike. Oh, Ike. That's so Dwight D. Eisenhower. No, so I'll stop yeah. that bit. So he also has some blue hair. That seems to be a popular choice. Ironic, seeing as Dwight D. Eisenhower was a candidate for the Republican Party, who are famously red. <laughs> so we're starting again. They've, someone's got to jump off, haven't they, for a bit? Oh, yeah. There so he goes. Ike has gone and no, Rob has gone and jumped off, mm. and now they're starting again. So. Oh. Oh shit. Oh shit. Yes. Oh yes. Someone said yes. So when are you celebrating? So what happens to the two who didn't get to play? Uh, tough luck for them, I suppose. Tough luck for them. That's harsh. I suppose Lucy really were the real winners, because yeah. they all got to have a go. <laughs> and that's no, really what, it, what it all comes down to. It's all about the having fun. Yeah, I suppose that must be it. Yeah. So, um, Hannah, this was, was this your first time watching other people play Smash whilst talking into a mic to a room full of strangers? <laughs> it, funnily enough, Andrew, it was. And what do you, what do you feel about the whole event? Um, the event is still ongoing. Yeah. <laughs> um, you know what? I've had a nice time. Have you? Uh, yeah. Good. I've learnt a lot about fighting techie. So, tell me the things you've learnt with reference specifically to Wally. Wally. Yeah, what have you learned about Wally? Well, he, he has a spinning top that he can throw at people. Right. I didn't see that in the film. <laughs> but they, that must have been a deleted scene. It's poetic <laughs> license, I think. Oh, yeah. But it seems to be quite effective on the human man, but then that makes sense because I don't think I'd like to have a spinning top thrown at me. No, that would rile me up proper. Mm. If you did that, I'd be distinctly cross. Yeah, you'd probably go off that ledge again. Yeah, probably. But well, again, didn't do it first. Oh, no. <laughs> Not quite. Don't laugh at me. Sorry. Um, okay, so, uh, Jake, how do you feel this is going? <laughs> That's a thumb down. Mm. Why, the Jake? The robot always seems able to get back on the, on the ledge. Is that technique or has the robot got superpowers? I think the robot's <laughs> got superpowers. Okay. See, look, he's got flying feet. Well, I mean, the whole of him flies. Mm. But the human, I don't think, has that. Okay. Because that, that is the thing about this game, Andrew, is that some characters are probably far superior than others. Yeah, and I don't know what they do to differentiate that. No. Is there some kind of handicap within game? Oh, like this, for this one, the robot could maybe shut down every now and again. Yeah, or they could handicap one of them. Like, take one of their legs off. Mm. <laughs> like an actual handicap. Yes. Like okay. I can't help but notice that nobody picked my favourite character. Who was your favourite character? Um, Zappy Zappy Yellow Mouse. Zappy Zappy Yellow Mouse, what's his real name? Um, Don't know. I believe he's played by um, uh, Ryan Reynolds. Ryan Re oh, oh, Pikachu! Mm. Zappy Zappy Yellow Mouse. 
My favourite character is Blonde Girl Number One, oh. who hasn't made an appearance as yet tonight, and no. certainly won't be doing. No, in fact, the one time I played this, she was oh, my chosen uh, player. Was she? Oh. 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 oh, oh! Come on, Ike! Come on! Come on, Ike! Oh shit! Oh, the robots rise up. We shouldn't use swords. <laughs> <laughs> so sword they is precisely zero percent effectual. <laughs> Although, to be honest, on the metric of tiredness, it should be like a hundred percent effectual. Oh, well done, gaming society. <laughs> that was a, a round of many ups and downs. Ups as they jumped, downs as they fell off the ground. <laughs> And uh, basically, the game society turned out to be triumphant. So well who'd have thought the ones that play games would be good at games? Yeah, I didn't think that. Slight selection error. Cameron should have paid attention. <laughs> yeah. This was entirely had, had, had the controls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. Marvellous. Now we're not going to uh, play another round of that. Next, we're going to be playing a, a game called Lovers in a Dangerous Space Time. Uh, I've had this briefly explained to me. I have not. Okay, well, why don't you tell me what you think it would be, and then I'll say what it is. Okay. So I'm thinking there's two characters who are lovers. Um, yeah, they could be. Yeah, and they are in a, sta a space time which it's is dangerous. Risky. Yeah. It's just a bit yeah. So they want to. Am I in the ballpark? Yeah, you are. Actually, oh, nice. By virtue of literally explaining the title. Yeah. Um, so, Lovers in a Distinctly Risky Space Time is uh, basically we've got a bunch of people on a ship, right? A spaceship, and they are going to try and pilot this together. <laughs> Am I right, Jim? Yeah, good. That's that. We're going to have a brief interlude now while they set that up. Yeah. <laughs> Post match interview. Post match. Well, let's do That's a good idea. Jim, you were playing. Yeah. <laughs> are you, uh, so, so what do you think went wrong? Can you give me up on the camera? My first mistake was putting shield and grab the wrong way around. Is that a control error? Well, no, it was a user error. Object, it was a problem with me. And uh, then that caused problems later down the line as Cameron uh, said he'd listened to us saying what controls went twice and fell off the edge because he didn't know how to jump uh, yeah, in the air. Yeah. That is very unfortunate. So which character are we in again? Also morale. Morale fell. Uh, and we, we didn't work as a team even though we were working one at a time. And that caused us to go out. So Jim, tell me, did you have any kind of chat along the way to tell your guy, you guys what you need to be doing differently, how you need to be improving, changing your strategy? I think I told someone to counter once. Okay. And you told Cameron to like pay attention and not be rubbish? Well, I said to Cameron, is that, is that okay? And he went, yeah. It wasn't. Look at that. Would you change character? Do you think you picked the wrong, the wrong character, Jim? Um, well, Ness is a flashy character, but he ain't easy to play. And I iced, when, no, I, I zapped when I should have flamed, and that's that what that was down for. Uh, well, thank, well, you did your hat on. Yeah. Well, that's the important thing. It is perhaps the only important thing. Um, just shout at me, did you enjoy yourselves? Yeah. Good. <laughs> I'm glad. So, um, for this next game, uh, we've had a bit of a change up. Uh, I, I think Lucy people and uh, gaming people are going to be working together. So, Ooh. Yeah, Ooh, in indeed. So, we're no longer in contention. We're, we're trying to get <laughs> together. Like the lovers. Oh, like the lovers! Yeah. Like, like, that's probably why they're called lovers in a dangerous yeah. space time. <laughs> and uh, that's uh, how it's going down. Kyle, raise your hand, Kyle. 
And you're paired up with Amy, is that right, Amy? Yeah, that's Amy there. I've been told distinctly to spell your name A-I-M-E-E, -E, which for some reason matters for me speaking it out loud. One person the other person You're green. Okay, so the green person is um, Amy and Kyle. They are called Lover New. Lover New. Okay. Um, we also have Bazaar. Raise your hand, Bazaar. Yeah, he was comparing earlier. And teamed up with him is... Um, Tom, I think. Ben. What's your name? Um, my name's Ben. Ben, yeah, that's right. And you're teamed up. Um, I mean, oh, that was other way around. Oh, okay. No, 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 other way around. With this person. With this person. Wait, what? So you're teamed with this person, Bazaar, I think. We're going to hear all this out loud. Over the microphone. Now I remember how this So Bazaar's here, he raised his hand, and he's with, what's your name? James, he's with James. So they're waving there. Then we've also got Tom and Ben, and they're together. And then we've got Ed and Jake, and they're together. Um, now, they're going to just sort out some remaining logistical errors. We find out who is Jake. Which colour are you? You're blue. Okay. They are lover. Oh, so long. Oh, and they've got What colour are you, James and, uh, sorry, Ben and Tom? Yellow. Okay, you're yellow, and that must leave you as the other colour. Blue. No, I'm not blue. Okay. Uh, 
the poor guy will be target beat. There is like a really annoying target on the other hand. What that is, I assume it's a bad guy. What's that other bit? Cow thing? Cow thing? I really don't know. Oh, it's there for him now. Um, so, at the moment they seem to be circling it. It's like, have you seen Die Hard? Ah, bits of it. Okay, have you seen the bit where all the planes, I think it's Die Hard 2, but it might be 3. I fly it's definitely 2. Okay. The one where they're in a Christmas. Oh, they save the bunnies. I'll come back to my Die Hard metaphor in a minute. Okay. So they save the bunnies. Now back to my Die Hard metaphor. With the Die Hard metaphor. It's like the planes in Die Hard, except it's not anymore, they're escaping towards the target beat. Oh, Jim has noticed something bad has happened. Ah, so they trip the laser. They trip the laser. Oh, shit. And it seems they've done it again. They use their shield to protect themselves. Ah, oh, that's clever. They have a little shield that looks like a nice uh, garden fence. I'm really impressed here because the developers seem like they've done it again. Every little mechanism you get screwed is sold. No, no, they probably didn't. It might have been. Oh, the bunnies are all. What are those bunnies doing? They're magic. They're magic bunnies. Okay, so you've opened the portal. They went into space without spacesuits on, didn't die. Oh, and the gate opened automatically. Will, right, so someone tell me, the structural integrity of the purple ship you're in... You can die. You will, so you can die. Yeah. That's, that's, that's a different way of saying what I was going to ask, which is, um, will you die? <laughs> <laughs> I can't help but notice, though, in the corner, that they've got seven out of five bunnies. Yeah. What? What? How do you get seven out of five? Five minutes of the portal taking the entire, like, Oh, I see, so this isn't a repeat of, like, getting Ooh. me out of over 100% in Smash Bros. by being able to have over 100 yeah. Yeah. Oh, you yeah. did, did you? Well done. Oh, it's the, the girls. So <laughs> Mission complete. Is that the, the sum total of love thingy in a thingy yeah. space? Yeah. Okay, so yeah. that's yeah. at the end of that chapter. Uh, well done, everyone. Uh, the final thing we're going to do, and, and Hannah and I are going to leave you all to it now, um, and goodness, is uh, they're going to play Mario Kart. Now, they're going to be in pairs. And one of them is going to be blindfolded, they're going to be operating the controls. The other one will not be blindfolded and they'll be telling them what to do, is that right? Yes. Good. So, um, it should hopefully lead to um, various episodes of hilarity. Um, and a lot of smashing at the walls. Oh, I'm just going to go back full circle to where we started, Hannah. So it's really just for us to sign off, Hannah. So, no, thank you, Hannah. Well, thank you, Hannah. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Shut up, Jordan. Um, is it free laps count? It's Can you see? Uh, As you can see, we are on oh, we're on 50 cc. Good time. Good time. Good time. Good time. Good time. Okay, no, we're on the cc. Yeah. Okay. Good luck. Basically, the higher the cc, the faster you go, and the more annoying it gets. Yes, 100 is fine. 200 is not fine. Yeah, press A. Press button until it starts working, Cameron. I'm blindfolding! <laughs> right then. You need, to help do, you need to help them get the boost at the start. <laughs> oh yeah, we're starting with that. Shall we set two and I'll test the two? So we're going to start off on Mario Kart Stadium, a very enjoyable stadium oh, in my opinion. This looks amazing. It is. Yeah. Go <laughs> well. It's 1v1. Just press. I'm surprisingly not on cross quick scope only. But here we go. So Cameron, if you will press A. He's in now. Go! Go! <laughs> right, well done. You, right. ha you have started. I don't want to do it. Uh, turn right, right, turn right, turn right, turn right, turn right, turn right. Wait, Cameron, left foot. Like on the left. Go. Forward. All right, right, we'll bring it forward. Go too far. Be right a bit. Left, 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 right, right. Forward, let go, let go, let go. Left. Left. Right, 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 right. Let go now, let go now. Right, go forward. Straight, 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 straight. No, no, no. I told you not to turn. Let go, let go. Turn. Be a left. Right, right, you're left. Right. Left a little bit. Here we go. No, no, no. Right a bit, right a bit, right a bit. Right a bit, 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 right a bit,
forward. Just, just, just hold it. No, turn right. Turn right, turn right a little bit. Be okay, right. Hold it. Yeah. Just hold it. What's the magnitude of the turn, Terry? <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> just, just keep going. Right. Uh, Cameron. We're on the, on the Whatever you're doing, stop doing it. Turn right. Turn right. 180 turn degrees. Turn right. Oh, no, 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 no. Forward. Please. Turn left. Turn left, Cameron. Forward now. Forward. Just hold it. Just hold it. Don't touch anything else. Now stop turning left. 
right a little bit. Left a little bit. Right, let's go forward. No, turn left a little bit. A little bit, there we go. Turn right a little bit now. Right, left. Right, left. Sorry, left. Sorry. you're bumping on every post. It's actually right, really forward. impressive. No, no, no. Help me. Help me. Help me. No. Okay, no. Thank you, Licky. You know what? That helped you. So turn left a little bit. Turn left a little bit more. Okay. Uh, yeah, stop. Good, good. good. Right. No, wait. No, left a little bit more. Hey, just hold it. You, this is close now. Just the turn left. Left, left, left. Now turn right. Brilliant, there we go. Change the front. Let's go forward. Let's change the right. Right. Oh, right. right. Keep changing. Right. Let's go forward. 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 Let's go
The tracks have changed. Oh. Right. Um, okay. now, we're um, still on the tracks. Go um, we're right. Okay, right, right. yeah, yeah thank you. I'm bad. Can right, I stop? No, no. no. Just, yeah, stop. No. Oh. What's going on? Can you go to uh, press the down button? Left. Down. Stop there. Oh, no, no, no. A bit too far left. Oh. What is happening here? Turn to the right, uh, press, going, yeah, press the oh, side button, turn to the right, turn, turn to the right, keep turning right, uh, stop. Yeah. Right, um, keep going. Yes. yes. The there line. we go. We're on the road. Right, We're right, off the road. Right. Um, okay, right. 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 Forward, forward, forward. 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 forward, forward. No, left a little bit. Forward. Don't worry first. Okay. Right. Right. Straight. Keep going straight. Okay. Left a little bit. Right. Yes, forward. No, left a little bit. Right, 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 right. Right. No, right, right. No, we're going in circles. We're back where we started. Yeah. Um, yeah. Very precise movement. So left, left, good, left, uh, left, 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 Yeah, straight. Keep going. No, 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 get it. Forward, 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 forward. Right, right a tiny bit, right a tiny bit. Yes, yeah. forward. Left. Forward, keep going straight forward. Yeah, straight forward. Straight, straight forward. forward. No, no, a bit too far. Yes! Right, 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 right. Yep, keep going forward. Yeah. All right, they just got right. Stuck in right. Oh, you know what? Keep going forward. Don't press anything. Just right. Yeah. Yes. Right. Right. We're right. yes. right. 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 on that two now. Right. Correct. Wrong. No, 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 no. 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 <laughs> Incorrect. Right. Hold that thing. Forward, forward, forward. Left a bit. Left, left. Oh no. Um, it's fine. We no, can do we it. Like right. We're still going forward. Yes. We got to move off. Oh no. Yeah. Just go forward. Straight forward. Straight forward. Straight. Yeah. Left a bit. Left a bit. Left a bit. Yeah. No. Keep going straight. Left a bit. Keep going. Straight forward, straight yeah, forward. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, straight forward. Yeah, straight forward. Good. Stop. Right, right you're gonna uh, grab to grab left. Now. No, we're so, off again. Um, straight yeah, forward, straight forward. Yeah, just keep going. Right, 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 oh, right. Go, uh, right, uh, uh, right, left. No, no. Right, 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 sure, no, right, left. Straight forward, right, forward. <laughs> um, right yeah. hold left. Yep, you're going good. Light, right, too far, too far, right. Right now, left. Left a little bit. That's a little bit more, right, you're going straight. No, so just keep. Oh. Maybe a little tiny oh, little bit. Uh, uh, just go left, 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 left. It's good. Yeah. Just um, only, more, yeah, uh, if you only tap A a small bit, like, we just keep going forward <laughs> slightly. Um, we've got off there, we'll get back. Right, yes, you're doing good. Uh, yes, uh, maybe uh, straight forward. forward. Right, a tiny bit, right, a tiny bit. Right, a tiny bit. Right, another right movement. Left, 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 keep going straight forward. Left, left, right, 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 right. Yeah, oh yeah, it's, uh, it's not going right, it's fine. Yeah, right. um, straight forward, straight ahead. Of... Straight forward. <laughs> it's right, so if you just keep going off eventually, you'll, you'll move further. Yeah, yeah keep, keep going, keep right, going, keep right, going. Right. Just push it forward. Right, okay. right. Okay. right. Yeah. We've been raided by the police. Oh. Yeah, you won. Right, right. You won. If I take the flame 